So in front of me, we've got some of my favorite iPhone 15 accessories. I've had the iPhone 15 Pro now for a couple of weeks. It took me a while to get hold of it, but it's finally here. Loving this phone. It's definitely a lot lighter than the previous version. It feels lighter anyway, and it's a lot nicer in the hand. It hasn't got those sharp edges, very smoothed off corners. And yeah, a bit of an improvement, not a massive jump in performance. I've not noticed that much over the iPhone 14 Pro Max. Um, by the way, I'll be comparing the cameras on this one soon because the camera is where there is an improvement. So yeah, stay tuned for that one, subscribe if you haven't already. Let's jump right into the accessories because I've got some cases, I've got some wallets, I've got a charger, MagSafe charger here as well, so I just want to show you the quad lock case first of all. This case is brilliant, let's put the phone in there. Now this is sort of my weekend case, um, I do a lot of bike riding, uh, mountain biking, road cycling, and this is a case I use to mount my phone to the bike. There's only one system as far as I'm concerned when it comes to mounting to a motorbike or a bicycle, this is quad lock. And yeah, the case the case itself is like quite basic. They're not overly expensive either. Range from about 20 pounds to 30 pounds here in the UK, but they're really good quality. I have found they're probably a little bit slippy in the hand. There isn't much grip on them, but when it's on the mount, they are just solid as a rock. Nice case, good camera lip, and some built-in buttons there, which are not molded. They're actually built-in buttons. They're nice. And then you've got the quad lock on the back. It comes in two versions. You've either got a MagSafe version or the normal version. This is a normal version because, like I said, I only use it for mounting it to my bike. So this is one of the mounts. This is the stem mount for mountain bike or road bike, and this is what it like goes onto. Sort of, you clip it in like so, push it down, and it clips in. Now, once it's on there, this is not coming off. So if you ride a motorbike and you want to store your phone on the handlebars, this is definitely the mount to go for. They are so, so strong. And yeah, you've probably seen them on Instagram. <laughs> anyway, there's loads of adverts. So push them pretty hard. But for a reason, they're very popular and they are very good quality. All you have to do is sort of push this and twist to take it off. There are different mounts. I've got an out front mount as well on the road bike. So yeah, fully recommend these cases from Quadlock. Like I said, for all of these cases and accessories will be links in the description down below. Those will be probably paid affiliate links. You don't have to purchase those links if you don't want to, but if I've got any discount codes or anything, I'll link them down below as well and in the pinned comment to try and save you some money. Okie dokie, so that's the quad lock. Really do like quad lock. I wouldn't be without it. I had one for the previous 14 and I've got one for the 15 now because I just use it every week. Um, let's talk about this case first from Magback. Now, Magback are another company I've featured in the past because they are phenomenal and they've sent me their new iPhone 15 Pro Max case here. So, I mean, again, relatively simple case, but it does come with this mag bar in the box, which is this thing, and I'll show you what it is in just a second. Um, so you've got MagSafe built in on the back. Nice, simple silicon case, fits the phone really nicely. Again, that really, this sort of color goes really nice with the titanium. That matches perfectly, actually. It's a really nice case. They are good quality, good camera lip, good protection, and you've got the cutouts on the bottom. But it comes with this little magnetic bar, which you can sort of mount in your car. It comes with 3M sticky on the back. You can put it on the wall. You can put it anywhere, really, that you want to mount your phone, and then this snaps on there. And it's the most unbelievably strong magnet you've come across. It must be rare earth metals or something because they are really fantastic. Um, so, so strong, and you can get multiple of these to sort of bang around. They, they sell them in packs of three, I believe, on the website as well, so you can just mount them in different locations, multiple cars, and yeah, it snaps on there like that. just stays on there. There's no way that's coming off. These are really good, incredible cases. So that's the case, but they actually do wallets as well, and this is their mag back wallet. They've sent me this sort of suede version. Um, comes like so, and then I'll do like this wallet for a few reasons. One, it works with the mag back system. It also has the magnets on the back there, so if you've got this on your phone and you want to mount it, it still mounts on there, and the magnets still clip onto the wallet there, really strong. I can't explain to you how strong those magnets are, they really are very strong. Now, this wallet actually can hold three cards, but it comes with like a finger loop as well, so you've got like a finger loop on the back, so you can hold your phone like so, um, and then you've also, if you take it off, and let's put some cards in there, I've got this other wallet I'm gonna show you in just a second. Card goes in like so, and then you've 
you've got this cutout on the bottom there where you can push the cards out, which is nice. I do like having a little cutout. You don't get that on the original Apple MagSafe wallets because it's just sort of a, a full piece there. But once you've got it in there, you can push it from either side, which is which is great. So these wallets, really fully recommend them. But just because that magnetic system, it's incredible. It really is. And they're really, really great quality as well. This is a nice suede and you know a nice sort of leather suede thing and it will sort of patina over time as well so yeah can't recommend these enough they're really fantastic cases and accessories so that is mag back did you see that oh my word i just put that on the and it just flicked onto the magnets they're so strong it's ridiculous okay so i've got these other cases from alfix now these cases i've really liked as well just because of the design i've got this sort of gunmetal gray one here comes in all different sizes colors this black color is like a really nice not Darth Vader-y kind of vibe to it. Um, but this gunmetal grey really goes well with the titanium. I mean, look how cool that looks on the phone. It looks so good. Then on the back of these cases, you've got this ring, which you can use to stand the phone up like so. And on the uh, landscape mode, and then you can sort of use it as like a finger loop as well. But they are MagSafe compatible, so all the like different wallets work with it like so. Um, so you can use that the, like there, and then we're going to show you this different wallet in just a second. So these all work with the um, the case. Obviously you can't use a ring if you've got a wallet on the back, but you can just take it off and stand it up. These are really great cases, linked in the description. Different colors come from all the different sizes as well. So iPhone 15 plus 15 Pro and Pro Max, you can get these cases for. They also do a standard one without the ring as well. It's just with the MagSafe ring built in the back. So yeah, really, really great, nice cases. And the nice little touch of this ring is that, you know, usually they're white on the Apple versions but they are actually color coded so you've got a black ring on the back of this one as well um, so yeah they're really nice cases really do fully recommend them this wallet from Muju is probably the wallet to go for for a couple of reasons so this is the Muju wallet um, linked in the description a couple of cards you get three to four cards in here you've got the cutout in the bottom where you can push the cards out a little bit to get them out easier it's got this sort of slanted cut on the top there so you can still get them out easier from the top as well unlike the Apple versions and then on the rear you've got this sort of rubber ribbed effect on the back to stop it slipping around now the magnets are pretty strong on there so it snaps on there nicely and then it doesn't slide around because you've got those rubber strips and that's something you haven't got on the apple versions that's why if anybody asks me about an apple wallet i always recommend this muju version because of those few features really nice leather a little bit pricey priced around 50 pounds just slightly more um a bit more expensive actually than the apple versions um but the quality of the build the quality of the materials and those extra features more than make up for it it's a really great apple wallet comes in different colors um so yeah whatever phone you go for you are sorted really like the wallet we all want to keep charged all day and I haven't, I haven't I haven't really noticed a massive improvement. In fact, I think the battery life is probably a little bit worse than the 14 Pro. If I'm having to charge this up with the USB-C cable a little bit more than I did with the 14 Pro Max. Um, so I'm not sure what that's about. Maybe they'll update that um, in a firmware update. But if you want to stay charged all day, you need a MagSafe power bank. And this one from Banks is the perfect one. Not only is this a great sort of subtle design, it's quite slim as well on the phone. So it doesn't sort of stick out too much. You can still use the phone easily enough when you're using it. And then it's got the USB-C charging port on the bottom. So you can charge it with your USB-C cable that you've now got on the iPhone 15. And then the little button there to check your charging um, status. We've got two bars still on this. And then we plonk it on and it charges away. You can see that it's charging the phone. Really nice, sleek and relatively well priced as well. This one from Bank. So yeah, that's my go-to MagSafe charger. One more case for you from a Unicorn Beetle. This is a Unicorn Beetle Pro. And if you're after the maximum, the absolute maximum protection for your iPhone 15, then this is the case to go for. This is a chunky boy. I do like it though. It's got some wicked features. So this is for the 15 um, plus. I've got like a 15 plus dummy model here. So I'm gonna just show you how we get on with getting this in here because it can be a little bit tricky. This has got like this outer rubbery shell, Ooh, like that. So it comes in two parts like this. Let's get rid of this foam plastic in the middle so this actually goes over the screen like that so it's got this sort of protective frame on the device like there 
and then we put this inside of the outer rubber sort of softer TPU protection for shock absorption and dust proof it's add a little bit of waterproofness to your device as well and this seals all around if we get it on there nicely like so then you've got this wicked really protective um, case on your iPhone so if you work for instance on a construction site or something this would be a perfect case for you so this is actually MagSafe compatible we've got a MagSafe ring on the back and this little switch right here you switch it down and then this little ring pops out and you can hop put it on the side to watch your favorite content YouTube Xander Rand's YouTube channel of course what else would you watch and and then you just sort of clip it back into place so that's wicked built-in buttons on the side as well sort of a plastic screen protector already built in and then it comes with this holster if you want to use a holster so this pops in like so snaps in there and then you can sort of clip that to your belt or your trousers or wherever you want to clip it and then we just flick that down like that to get the phone out so you know for the ultimate protection of your device these are great options they really are well priced as well like i said links in the description come in various different designs and colors but if you want the ultimate protection this is the bad boy to go for okay we've got some great accessories there ones i use every single week like i said quad lock amongst my favorite magback amazing these two accessories the wallet and the charger they're my go-to the ultimate protection with the unicorn beetle case and then you've got these wiki cases from alfex as well so you know pretty much got you covered on all protection and accessory needs if you want to grab any of these like i said links in the description let me know your favorite accessories in the comments down below i'll be interested to know what you guys are using on your iphone 15 if you've got any ideas i'll try and test them out for you as well okay that's it for this one though enjoy using your new phone be careful keep it protected stay safe out there see you soon guys bye